Somebody lift up your voice. Let's start to worship the Lord. Let's worship him. Let's give him all the praise. He is worthy of our praise. Lift up your voice right now in Jesus' name. Lift up your voice. God has sent me specifically to a man of God, to a woman of God under the sound of my voice. And the Lord is partnering with you. Whatever you say now, whatever you say right now, God is going to use to place things in the right proportion in your life, in our lives. Somebody prophesy. Somebody talk to the Lord. Somebody let the spirit of the Lord echo, 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 echo the mind and the heartbeat of God right now. Let it echo, echo the mind and the heartbeat of God through you in the name of Jesus Christ. Who is that person that the Lord, who is that person that the Lord is using right now? Who is that person that the Lord is walking through right now in the name of Jesus Christ? God is walking through you. God is walking through you to ensure that all the things that he has intended for your household, for the ones around you, your community and nation, that everything falls into line. Somebody join me in the name of Jesus. Father, we plead the blood, we plead the blood, we plead the blood of Jesus. Daddy, we plead the blood, we plead the blood, we plead the blood in the name of Jesus Christ. We plead the blood, Adonai, we plead the blood, El Shaddai, we plead the blood in the name of Jesus Christ. Rakabamusuka Kandali Eketelio. We plead the blood, we plead the blood in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now, in Jesus' name, everything that is not of God, as you start to address them now, they start to fall into line. Somebody say, not my will, your will be done. Father, I'm willing, I'm ready to answer to your divine call. Somebody is ready to walk with the Lord and answer to the divine call. There is power in your tongue. So everything you're saying, everyone is taking note. There is power in your tongue in Jesus' name. Somebody, what do you want God to do? Ask of him right now and it will, God will surprise you. Ask of him the way he's led it in your heart. But at the end of the day, we are saying not our will. We're saying not our will, but the will of God be done. Not our will. Today, God wants to answer somebody's long-standing prayer mandate. Long-standing prayer mandate in Jesus' name. <clears throat> Today, God wants to answer a long-standing prayer mandate. I don't know whether it's health-related or financial you know, related financially, but I know that God wants to answer a long-standing you know, prayer mandate in Jesus' name. Somebody under the sound of my voice. Somebody under the sound of my voice. So be very careful of the things you're saying on this on this particular platform. Please be careful. That's what the Holy Spirit has observed to me. Everyone that will be praying today, please be very careful of what you are requesting for. If you're not sure, don't even ask of it. Leave it for now until when you are fully sure. Until when you're fully sure of what you want God to do. But whatever you ask right now, right now the power of the holy spirit will come upon it whatever you ask right now the power of the holy spirit will come upon it in jesus name and the lord the lord will make it to fall unto you whatever you ask right now will fall unto you in jesus name whatever you ask in jesus name it will fall unto you it will fall unto you in jesus name it will fall unto you whatever you ask in jesus name god is here to maintain to maintain everything that you have lifted up before him somebody in the name of jesus christ god wants to maintain everything god wants to maintain everything that you lift up before him right now today in the name of jesus christ god wants to maintain and make sure that everything is exactly the way you you the way he has intended, the way you are asking it, but it will be in his will, in Jesus' name. So, somebody asking for deliverance, for example, you are going to get it. Somebody asking for restoration, you are going to get it. But be very careful of what you are asking, because exactly what you are asking, the Lord said, a long-standing prayer mandate, he is going to attend to a long-standing prayer mandate. Who is this person? Who is this person that the Lord is focused on right now? The healing you're asking for, the divine healing, the Lord is focused, the Lord is focused, is going to be very, very glorious. The Lord say you flourish in that prayer mandate. What is that prayer mandate that has been uppermost in your heart? 
it's been uppermost in your heart. The Lord said you're going to flourish in, in, in that prayer mandate because he's going to attend to that prayer mandate. He's going to attend to that prayer mandate in the name of Jesus Christ. He's going to attend to that prayer mandate in Jesus' name. Libra Musoka, Jali Ketelio, Kontara Bamusoka, Bali Eketelie. In the name of Jesus Christ, everyone asking for, for request, prayer mandate, regarding marriage regarding your marriage any prayer mandate regarding marriage the lord start to brew the lord start to move the lord start to establish everything that he has ordained concerning your marriage concerning your children concerning everyone related to you by blood in the name of jesus christ i come against every spirit of depth upon depth every spirit of depth upon depth upon depth from now on in jesus name i confess I confess and I agree with you that you recover from that debt, from that bad debt, you recover from it in Jesus' name. You recover from that bad debt, you recover in the name of Jesus Christ. The wisdom you need, the divine favor you need, the leading that you need is is coming upon you straight away you recover from that bad, bad debt in this month of restoration in jesus name restoration is your portion help will not be far from you everyone asking for help help will not be far from you in jesus name i soak your son with the power and the blood of jesus christ and i decree that in jesus name this long lasting prayer mandate the lord attend to you immediately that things turn around for you for your son in school amongst his friends even from now even into the future in the name of jesus christ you are asking for freedom i pray for the mercy of god i pray for the freedom of god upon you in the name of jesus christ in every realm you want god to intervene and set you free and fight your battles in jesus name the lord the lord hear your cry this long lasting prayer mandate the lord answer the one that is asking for favor upon your children i use this prayer mandate as a point of contact to every children represented on this mountain in jesus name i use this prayer mandate as a as a yardstick as a point of contact that cover every child represented on this mountain in the name of jesus christ with the power and the blood of jesus christ somebody that have been full of benevolence somebody that has been full of benevolence in jesus name i'm decreeing over you over you over your household that benevolence the lord start to reward your benevolence nature that your attitude of giving blessing the lord start to reward the lord reward that attitude of giving and that attitude of blessing the lord start to reward that attitude that attitude of giving giving and blessing blessing the lord start to reward in jesus name right now in jesus name i pray for your daughter i pray in jesus name that the lord will sort her out a starting job and i use this prayer mandate as a as a point of contact to to everyone seeking job on this mountain in jesus name god will grant you this kind of job that will that would set you up in life in a way that you start to set other people up in jesus name you will not meet with what we, what is called job hazard everyone that the lord will grant the opportunity and the mercy and favor to get a job you will not in jesus name meet with anything called job hazard in jesus name because christ will go before you and behind you god will go before you and behind you to make all crooked places straight in jesus name all 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 that your hand find it to do in jesus name everything that your hand find it to do in jesus name everything that your hand find it to do success will flourish they will flourish success will be the trademark it will flourish everything your hand finds to do in jesus name i pray for anyone 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 struggling with anything whatsoever whether in the home whether in your job whether in your business i command the power of struggling to be brought in your life the power of struggling in jesus name the lord say I, I i lay i lay in zion a stone a tried stone a precious corner stone a sure foundation that is who you are a precious corner stone a sure foundation in jesus name every power of struggling everything that is making you to struggle every power of struggling i command it to be broken now in jesus name you will not struggle anymore you will not struggle you will not strain anymore in jesus name you will not struggle you will not strain
Oh kaka kaka la manteli moso ribramo o lagrima telios o kaka bashin telie galioska in the name of Jesus Christ everyone that is struggling in any form struggling with your finances struggling in any form struggling with your bills may the lord make a way for you everyone struggling in any form struggling with the bills of the school fees of the children in Jesus name the lord make a way the lord make a way for you in Jesus name the lord make a way in Jesus' name, the Lord make a way. Anyone that is struggling in any form with bills, anyone struggling with the school fees, the school unit, the school fees of the children, anyone struggling with the bills, with the rent, in Jesus' name, the Lord make a way for you. The Lord make a way for you in Jesus' name. That rent that is disturbing you is the least, is the least amount you ever pay between now and the next is the least amount you ever pay wherever you're living because the Lord changed your level. The Lord changed your level. The Lord enlarged your coast. That's what I'm praying for. That the Lord enlarge your coast. You're no more struggling with that rent in Jesus' name. You're not struggling with those children's bills, those children's school fees in Jesus' name. <coughs> You're not struggling with any bill anymore. You're not struggling with finances anymore in Jesus' name. The favor of God, the favor of God. Somebody that is trusting God for promotion promotion in one way or the other i don't know which office you are eyeing and you're trusting god to take you to bring you into that office right now in jesus name i i decree that the grace to to be able to you know be part of the office that you're trusting god for may be a reality for you in jesus name the grace the grace the grace to be part of the office you are trusting god for the grace to be part of the office you're trusting god for in jesus name may it be possible may it be a reality the grace to be part of that office in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Kara Dalimo. Jeketelio. Rematosuka. Plan Mosi Katava. Somebody under the sound of my voice, please be very conscious. Please be very conscious because God is listening to every every prayer that we are praying for ourselves and for the people God has planted us on this mountain to stand in the gap for. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yekaba Shantayaba. Reka Dalimo Suka. Rekrelemo O Taliman Talio. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. I say it again in Jesus' name that everyone that God has planted on this mountain to pray in Jesus' name. Be careful of your decree because the Lord will grant every decree in, a, in line with his will. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. You have that power. You have that power. You have that power. You have that power. In the name of Jesus Christ. Rekaba Shaka Tosikayaba. Focus and use it correctly. Focus, use it correctly. Focus, use it correctly. Focus, use it correctly. Use it correctly. Hallelujah. Focus and use it correctly. The power God has given to you, the power in your system, focus, use it correctly. Focus and use it correctly. Focus, use it correctly. Focus and use it correctly. In the name of Jesus Christ, you have power inside of you. Focus and use, use it correctly. The power that God has put inside of you, that power can kill and can make a life. That power can kill and can make a life. You have that power, focus and use it correctly. In Jesus' name, somebody join me and say my tomorrow. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Somebody join me, say my tomorrow will be greater than today. In the name of Jesus Christ, very quickly, my tomorrow. My tomorrow, your tomorrow, my tomorrow will be greater than today. In the name of Jesus Christ, my tomorrow. Focus, focus. Somebody say with me, I flourish, I flourish. I flourish in everything that my hand find it to do. Somebody join me and confess. Say, I flourish. I start to flourish in anything and everything my hand find it to do. I flourish in Jesus' name. I flourish in anything and everything my hand find it to do. I flourish, I flourish in Jesus' name. I flourish in anything and everything my hand find it to do. In the name of Jesus Christ. Shakaba. Rematosuka. I flourish in Jesus' name. I flourish, I flourish in anything and everything my hand find it to do. Anything and everything. Anything, everything my hand find it to do. I flourish, I flourish in Jesus' name. Somebody decree. Somebody decree by fire, by force. I flourish in anything and everything my hand find it to do. Rabba Musuka Shandali Eketelio. In Tariban Telio. I flourish, I flourish in anything and everything my hand find it to do. Who is this person that the Lord has planted in this place? 
to make this conscious confession, to make this conscious proclamation. And as you're making this conf confession and proclamation, the Lord put his grace, the Lord put his power, the Lord put his mercy, the Lord put his seal upon it. In, you flourish, you flourish, you flourish. Your children flourish in Jesus' name. No more will you get any bad result from your children or get any bad report from your children because they will excel in everything that the, their hand find it to do. The Lord make them to excel. Your children will excel. They will excel. They will excel in everything their hand find it to do. In the name of Jesus Christ, I say your children will excel. Your children will excel in Jesus' name. In everything their hand find it to do, your children will excel in Jesus' name. Rabba Musu Kakali Bantelio, Reke Ribala Katalio, O Kabanjate Eketeli Mantelio. In the name of Jesus Christ, your children excel. They will excel in anything and everything their hand find it to do. In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ, I say your children. They will flourish, they will flourish, they will flourish. They will flourish in Jesus' name. They will flourish. Your children, your family, everyone connected to you by blood will flourish in Jesus' name. They will flourish in anything and everything their hand find it to do. In Jesus' name, praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. In the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody, please do not stop. Join me to say, My tomorrow will be greater. Not by might, nor by power, but by the Spirit of the Lord. Say my tomorrow, my tomorrow will be greater in the name of Jesus Christ. So shall it be. My tomorrow, your tomorrow will be greater. By fire, by force, it will be greater. It will be greater because the Lord said so. It will be greater in the name of Jesus Christ. Your tomorrow, my tomorrow will be greater than today. Hear us as we call, O Lord God Almighty. Everyone pressing the like button. Everyone pressing the share button. I soak you with the power and the blood of Jesus. Everyone under the sound of my voice pressing the like button. Everyone pressing the share button. I soak you with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, I soak you, I soak you. I soak you with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus' name. Oh Lord, confirm your blessing in my life. Confirm your glory in my life. Confirm, O oh Lord, in the life of everyone under the sound of my voice that you are a prayer answering God. Confirm, O oh Lord. O oh Lord, come and confirm. Come and confirm. Confirm, O oh God, that you are a prayer answering God in my life by what you will start to do as we enter into the new week. By what you start to do as we enter into the new week in the name of Jesus Christ. Who is this person God is focusing on right now? Who is this person God is focusing on? on right now by virtue of what god will start to do in your life in jesus name by virtue of what god will start to do in your life jacaba shantaraba reke balike tell you on tariban tell you ukala tell you in jesus name by virtue of what god will start to do in your life let everyone know let everyone know that you are serving a living god that you are serving a living god you are serving a god that will never fail you are serving a god that answered by fire in Jesus' name, as we round up this session, in Jesus' name, somebody, in Jesus' name, confess with me, my tomorrow is great because, because of the blood of Jesus, because of the power of the Holy Spirit. My tomorrow is great because I have God, because he lives in me, because I have God, because there's nobody that can separate me from my tomorrow. In the name of Jesus Christ, my tomorrow is glorious, my tomorrow is beautiful. In the name of Jesus Christ, nothing will separate me from the love of Christ. In Jesus' name, everyone that needs healing in their body, today I beseech the mercy of God, the glory of God, the power of God to sort you out. Yes, to sort you out. Somebody trusting God for healing. <clears throat> I decree in Jesus' name the mercy of God, the glory of God. Let, his, let the glory and the power of God sort you out today in Jesus' name. Let the glory and the power of God sort you out today in Jesus' name. Lagabashan tali mosoka. Rekre e teli man tell you. O ragabamo o karantali. In the name of Jesus Christ. Adonai in Jesus' name I give you praise. El Shaddai I bow before you because there is none like unto you Jehovah. In the name of Jesus Christ from the crown of our head Lord to the soles of our feet Daddy come and administer your will. Rebuke the devourer in Jesus' name. Thank you for what you will start to do in our life you're already doing and what you continue to do in the life of our loved ones and everyone related to us by blood father in jesus name we have no other god but you and we know that jehovah as we have totally submitted unto you daddy you will take preeminence and you will do what you alone can do in our lives you will do what you alone can do in our life in everything that 
is related to us in Jesus' name. Thank you. Daddy, thank you. Thank you for your joy. Thank you. Thank you, oh God, for everyone that you are blessed with the fruit of the womb. Thank you. Thank you for everyone you have lifted up. Thank you. Thank you for everyone, Jehovah, that you are proving yourself as a prayer answering God to thank you. Thank you, oh God, for the broadcast of today, for everyone that is already receiving, that will continue to receive greatness, mercy, and power from you, Lord God. We give you praise in Jesus' name. We have decreed amen, so shall it be. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen, so shall it be. In Jesus' name, we have decreed so shall it be, so shall it be. In Jesus' name, I appreciate everyone on the mountain. Shalom, shalom, shalom unto you. Please be your brother's keeper as you share, 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 so that everyone can be part of what God is doing on the mountain right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Please somebody help us to type the word maintain. The word maintain, maintain, maintain. Please help us to type the word maintain. The word maintain. Praise God, praise God, praise God. Help us to type the word maintain. The word maintain, maintain, maintain. The word maintain in Jesus' name. Help us to type the word maintain. Help us to type the word maintain. Thank you, Mary Al, for typing the word maintain. Praise God. Yay, W, thank you for typing the word maintain. Maruje, thank you for typing the word maintain. Maintain is the word we're focusing on. Sherry H, thank you for typing the word maintain. Praise God, praise God. Thank you, Grace C, for typing the word maintain. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Brenda W, for typing the word maintain. Praise God, maintain, maintain, maintain. Maintain, maintain. How would you explain the word maintain? How would you explain the word maintain? The word maintain, maintain, maintain. Praise God, hallelujah, praise God, praise God. How would you explain the word maintain? The word maintain, hallelujah, praise God. How would you explain the word maintain? Praise God, praise God, praise God. To keep very simple and straightforward. Thank you, Brenda W. To keep, to keep, praise God. To keep, maintain, to keep, to do the right things. Thank you, Sherry H. To, to do the right things, to continue. Thank you, Maro J, for that insight. For that insight, to continue. Somebody, God, will continue what he's doing already in your, in your life. To enable, praise God, to achieve and to, to achieve. Okay, I start with the word to achieve. To achieve a constant standard or output. Thank you for that provide thank you to to take care thank you to keep thank you to keep or steady pattern thank you thank you um christina do thank you angelica thank you thank you to to retain thank you maroje to retain state something strongly to declare something strongly you know, to, to maintain your stand. I know what you mean. To declare something strongly. To sustain. Thank you for that word. To sustain, to keep their synonyms. Thank you for that word. To keep a standard. That is beautiful. Thank you, Susan K., for that observation. To keep a standard. To keep a standard. To carry on. To carry on. To carry on a pattern, to carry on, to maintain, 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 to maintain, praise God. What about somebody, please, please type the word falling onto me, falling onto me falling onto me to keep in existence maintain thank you for that word please what about the word falling onto me falling onto me the word falling onto me 
Somebody help us to type the word falling unto me. Properly care for. Yea, W, thank you for that word. What about falling unto me? Thank you, O Tolu, for typing the word falling unto me. Falling unto me. Praise God, falling unto me. Render W, thank you for typing. Falling unto me. The word falling unto me. Falling unto me. Thank you for typing. Maru J T N A B A. Thank you. Falling unto me. Praise God. Praise God. Falling unto me is the word we are focused on now. Falling unto me. Somebody help us to type the word falling unto me. Falling unto me. Falling unto me. Thank you for the word falling unto me. The word falling unto me. In Jesus' name, the word falling unto me. Thank you for typing KDR 2 S, the word falling unto me. Praise God. Thank you, Sherry H, for typing. Grace C, thank you for typing. When you see the word falling unto me in the scripture, how would you describe it? How would you understand the word falling unto me? Falling unto me. To drop or come down. Brenda, thank you. To drop or come down. Sherry H describes it as blessings. Falling unto me. Blessings. Thank you. Thank you, Anjuma, for typing. How would you explain the word falling unto me? How would you explain the word falling unto me? <clears throat> How would you explain the word falling unto me? Angelica, you make me laugh so much. Thank you for the description. Like falling into the arms of somebody, that that's what we need to fall into, do, fall into the arms of God. Well done. Falling unto me. Beautiful. Thank you so much. Thank you. Falling unto me. Falling unto me. Maru J says, no disappointment. Falling unto me. Falling unto me, praise God. Falling unto me, falling unto me. How would you describe the word falling unto me? How would you describe the word falling unto me? How would you describe the word falling unto me? Falling unto me. How will you describe the word falling unto me? To bow and worship. Okay, praise God. To bow and worship. I will have to round up very quickly because uh, there, there's so many things we need to do on the mountain today. Falling unto me, how would you quickly explain the word falling unto me? Very quickly. How would you explain the word falling unto me? How would you describe the word falling unto me? Praise God. To let go and let go. I like that, Marie J. That's good. That's good. To let go and let God. Praise God. Falling unto me. First, I want to prophesy over somebody. I do not know what you have lifted up before God Almighty. But I say it with all humility right now that in Jesus' name, may the Lord maintain everything that you have lifted up before God. Whatever you've lifted before God, may God maintain in Jesus' name. May God maintain in the name of Jesus Christ. Anything and everything you have lifted before God, may God maintain for you. Anything and everything you've lifted before the Lord, may the Lord maintain for you and your household in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever you have lifted before the Lord in Jesus' name, may God maintain. Your finances, may God maintain. Your spiritual life, may God maintain. Your emotional life, may God maintain in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever you have lifted before the Lord, 
the, the Holy One of Israel. Have you lifted up any part of your body aching? Any part of your body you need a touch? You need, a, you need fresh anointing? In Jesus' name, may the Lord maintain... May the Lord maintain the original purpose he has for that part of your body. May the Lord maintain in Jesus' name. May the Lord heal. May the Lord heal all those requests you have put before God. May they fall unto you on pleasant places. May they fall unto you right now. All those prayer mandates you have lifted and you will lift up today. Every prayer mandate you have lifted, you have lifted before now. May it fall unto you in ple on pleasant places. Everyone that is pressing like button, love button, may favor of God fall unto you in every pleasant place. May the favor of God locate you. May the mercy of God locate you. May the favor of God locate you. May the mercy of God locate you. May it fall unto you in pleasant places in the name of Jesus Christ. May the mercy of God, the glory of God fall unto you. Every blessing, everyone pressing the like button, the share button, double, double anointing double double blessing fall unto you on pleasant places may it fall unto you in jesus name may it fall on pleasant places in jesus name in the name of jesus christ every prayer every prophecy everything that will be decreed on this mountain you will not miss out in anything you will not miss out in anything and everything god has intended what God intended for you and your household. You will not miss out in anything whatsoever. In the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord hear you when you call. The Lord hear you in Jesus name. The Lord hear you when you call. The Lord have mercy upon you and have mercy upon your household. The Lord wipe away any form of tears. Any form of tears. Whatever is bringing tears to your eye. May the Lord God Almighty take away by fire by force. Right now, may the glory of God, the power of God, take away anything, everything, bringing tears to your eye. In Jesus' name, rather, let joy fall unto you. Let joy fall unto you. Let happiness fall unto you and your household. Let happiness fall unto you and your household, your children, in Jesus' name, on pleasant places. Let it fall unto you in Jesus' name. Rekaba, Shandalima, and tell you. Kora ba musukataba in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ kan dali musuka rabra mo usakra bali ketelio I come against every every bad storm I come against any natural hazard in Jesus name that want to plague anyone any location I plead the blood of Jesus I plead the power of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus Christ every prayer mandate lifted. In this regards, in Jesus' name, receives mercy, favor from God, and every natural disaster. In Jesus' name, the Spirit of the Lord lift up a standard against it. In Jesus' name, so shall it be. As we lift up prayers unto God <coughs> on this holy mountain, as we lift up prayers unto God, in the name of Jesus Christ, shall daily makapa. As you lift up prayers unto the Lord, let every prayer mandate be attended to by fire, by force, immediately. In Jesus' name, right now on this mountain, somebody under the sound of my voice, the joy of God, the mercy of God, not, will not be only for you, but for your household and everyone related to you by blood. In Jesus' name, so shall it be. In Jesus' name, so shall it be. In Jesus' name, so shall it be. Hallelujah, praise God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise God. Hallelujah, praise God. Glory to God, hallelujah. May the Lord gladden your heart. May the Lord hear you when you call. May the Lord attend to all prayers that you have lifted up unto him on this holy mountain faith clinic and healing atmosphere anyone under the sound of my voice that is weeping your weeping comes to an end immediately by fire by force in jesus name so shall it be so shall it be so shall it be in jesus name somebody under the sound of my voice god sent me to you a lot of people are the architect of their problem but they will never believe if you told them that the problem came from them a lot of people have misused the power god gave to them because they look at it as very little or small. Sometimes things that are little and very small can be very, very great in, in function. Can be very, very great and very powerful in function. A lot of people misuse the power of communication, the power of tongue. The power of the tongue, the power of communication. We need to be very careful. We need to be very careful. We need to be very careful in the name of Jesus Christ.
Do you know that every, every satisfaction the belly will have, every satisfaction the belly of a man will have is from the fruit of his mouth. Now you have to understand what that means. Let's come down with that scripture and look at it the way the Holy Spirit said we should look at it. Proverbs chapter 18 verse 20 to 21. Proverbs chapter 18 verse 20 to 21. Please follow me in the spirit. Please follow me in the spirit. If you listen carnally, you will not understand. You will not understand to the, the rema and what God has blessed us with today. But if you follow me in the spirit, you will digest it in a unique way that you can use in your life. Maybe somebody who came here with financial challenge, you would digest it that in a way that it will cure that financial situation. Somebody who need healing, like somebody put a prayer request about healing, trusting God for healing, you would digest what I want to say now in the area of healing. Because God is here to enable us. God sent me specific to, specifically to somebody. Okay, Now, any form of satisfaction this physical belly will have, the physical belly of everyone, any satisfaction is from here, is from this mouth, is from the proceeds of this mouth, is from the fruits of this mouth. Whichever way you look at it, this belly, God is saying, will get satisfaction from anything and everything surrounding this mouth. Now you need to look at two things. Because people will not understand, that's why the Lord made there to be the next verse 21 to ex expand Now, there are two types of fruits you can get from this mouth. There are two types of fruit. You can get a physical fruit and you can get spiritual fruit. But out of the two, the most powerful is the spiritual fruit. Because the spiritual fruit still controls the physical fruit. I will repeat what I say. It's not tautology. It's not tautology. There are two types of fruits you are going to get from this mouth. You get physical fruits from this mouth immediately, and you can get spiritual fruits from this mouth. Now, whichever way you look at it, out of these two fruits, the physical fruits and the spiritual fruits, the most powerful is the spiritual fruit, because the spiritual fruit can produce the physical fruit. Let us explain a little bit further. Let us look at it carnally, humanly speaking. The first fruit you get is that this mouth feeds the body. My belly, to get this water, I will have to drink this water. Physically, I've drank out of the water. And my belly will be blessed because of the fruit of my mouth. That's the physical one. If I feel like eating, I'll be satisfied based on the physical food I will put into my mouth. As I put it into my mouth, my belly will be okay. Once my belly is okay, before you know it, the digestive system God has put in my body, it will give me energy and I can do what I need to do. Praise God. So the fruit of the mouth will bring, in, will bring you know, satisfaction to my belly. Then he said again, the increase of his lips shall be filled. The increase of his lips shall be filled. Now, with the increase of... Of his leaves shall be filled. So now the physical one, I'm taking my food, I'm eating this, I'm eating that, and everything. That is the physical one eating this mouth physically, chewing things, grabbing things in. But the second one that is the spiritual fruit, we look down on that. A lot of people regard the physical one so much because people tell you, I'm working so that I can at least I have something to eat. <coughs> people really. You know, pay attention to the physical one. Eating, have you eaten? Are you sure you don't want to eat? Let me take you out for dinner and things like that. Now, there is in this particular mouth also a, another power. So the first power sustains this body. That in a nutshell. The food you're eating sustains this body. End of story. When the belly is satisfied, every other part of the body will be satisfied. That is the first one. The second one is very equally important. And that is verse 21. Verse 21 says that death and life is in the power of the tongue. And the tongue is still in the mouth. And that is just the, the part of communication. The part of communication, vocalizing, speaking out. We don't see that as a fruit. Some of us, most of the problem we have, just like if you eat the wrong food, 
You know how your tummy, if some people, God forbid, make mistake to eat poison. You see how the tummy will turn. That is how some people have confessed poison. People have confessed poison. And that's why their life, that's why their place of work, that's why they are, every time they say men are this, men are that, men are this, men are that, they confess poison. That's why every time they meet with a man, they meet with a man that is in line with their confession. Because they are confessing death, every man that is coming their way will be acting out death to them. But they don't know that they are the architect of their problem. They are the creator of the problem that they are facing. And so when they speak in quote, their spiritual belly is satisfied. What is the spiritual belly? Your destiny. The life you are living in. You are the one creating the things around you because God has already warned us. If you confess life, you will see your belly, your destiny, your life will be satisfied because life will come around you. Even though everybody is getting death, because you are releasing the fruit of life, you will get the fruit of life. The power of life and death is in the tongue. Look at what it says. And they that love it shall eat, shall eat. Again, he referred to it, the fruit thereof. So you mean talking is also a form of a fruit. Just like eating is a fruit. The ability for this mouth to eat that is one fruit or one gift. That is that's, it's a fruit that is nourishing the body. Also, you're speaking. Like now you're communicating, you're typing certain things. I am telling you, God will respond according to those communications. God will respond. And a lot of people are careless. They say, but I didn't mean it. I was just saying it. I didn't mean it. I just said it at the top of my tongue. There is nothing like that in the spirit realm. If you dare to eat anything into your system and say, I ate it by mistake. Well, sorry. It will be digested because it has entered your system except you can bring it out. There is nothing like eating by mistake. Once you've eaten, you've eaten. There is nothing like saying anything by mistake. Once you say it, you've said it. Once you think it, that is it. The worst is you think it and then you say it. That is it. There is no going back. There is no going back. Anybody who loves to use communication rashly will receive the fruit of using it rashly. Anybody who loves to use it correctly will receive the fruit of using it correctly. Haven't you noticed that those who say, I am, I will not be, I will, I will, I can never be poor, never be poor, never be poor. God will supply my need, supply my need. Watch them that somehow, in an unexplainable way, the Lord supplies for them. Take note, those who believe that, no, in case there's danger, in case there's trouble, and they confess it, watch them. They are always having narrow escape from trouble, narrow escape from danger, narrow escape from problems. <clears throat> How else would God make us conscious of this when he said, let the weak say, I am strong. He did not say, acknowledge your weakness. Because God knows that there is a fruit. And the spiritual fruit, those ones that you're coming out from your mouth that cannot be seen with the physical eye, is more powerful. It's more powerful. It's more powerful than the food we are eating. It can produce the food you're eating even. It can produce shelter. It can produce everything. This spiritual, this second fruit is more powerful. That's why we need to be careful of our confession. Be careful of what you say. If you are angry, don't say anything, if possible. Don't say anything within those period. If you are too happy, you are extremely excited, don't say anything at that time. So that you don't say something that you'll be wondering, did I really mean what I have said? I want to say something, for example. Everyone pressing the like button, everyone pressing the love button, everyone pressing the share button, everyone in Jesus' name that is making a comment on this mountain, in Jesus' name, double, double, double blessing upon you double double blessing upon you and your children and you will use the power of the tongue correctly you will use the power of this mouth correctly my god you will use the power of this mouth correctly when you open this mouth it will bring favor for you when you open this mouth it will bring mercy unto you when you open this mouth to speak it will bring god closer to you it will not drive god away when you open this mouth it will bring angels closer to you in the name of Jesus Christ. It was the mouth David opened to praise God. And God said, I found a man whose heart pants after me. It was this mouth. It was this mouth root open and say, may your God be my God. 
Where you die is where I want to die. And God changed her destiny. The fruit of this mouth. Anybody who loves the fruit of this mouth, we eat thereof. If you love confessing negativity, women are this, women are that, women are this, you have to be careful, women are that. Watch the kind of women that come to such people. Because that's, the, that's what they have sown. That's what they have sown. Why do you think in Matthew chapter 5 verse 44, Jesus say you should bless those who curse you? Why will Jesus ever say this? Because Jesus knows that what you say is what is coming to you. It's not what people say to you. What people say to you is going back to them because it's their property. God punish the devil. Punish, punish, punish. What they say belongs to them. What you say belongs to you. The power of life and death. The power of life and death. Shape your tomorrow in this broadcast by what you're going to say. I am more than a conqueror. I am a winner. Nothing can separate me from the love of Christ. I am on top. God is my strength. I am breaking through. I will pay this debt. Don't say, I don't think I, will, I, I, don't think I can ever pay this debt. Don't tie yourself with the net of this spiritual gift. Rather, lose yourself up. Release yourself into freedom. I will pay this debt and I will give people soft loan. Confess. Look at yourself in the mirror and say, you are highly favored. You are blessed. You're going to places. God is with you. Success is your portion. You will never fail in life and destiny. You will conquer in this battle of life. What are you saying about yourself? It matters so much. What are you saying? What can you say about yourself? Hey, he called me this. Forget what he's calling you. He's seeing me and describing me this way because I'm black. Forget that he's his problem. He's the one that is stereotype. He's the one that is myopic. What do you see about yourself? What do you see? Can you see yourself the way God sees you? Can you confess about yourself the way God is confessing about you? Shantali Mosi Kataba. I am coming out of this sickness. Tell yourself. My body, you will not be here forever. I am walking out of this sickness. I am not going to be like this. What are you saying? What can God meet in? What can God, what can God say about you? What can God say about you? Why do you think Jesus came back to say in Matthew 7, 7, Ask and it shall be given unto you. What do you think Jesus means? He's telling you how to make use of the power of your mouth, of your tongue. The power, the fruit of your mouth is telling us. Because this fruit of asking can produce the first fruit of physically eating. Of satisfying the belly. Just like your belly can be physically satisfied by the mouth eating food. Also when you confess, your destiny can be satisfied. Your destiny can be satisfied. You can be a more than a conqueror. You can never be a victim. You'll be a victor. If you confess and you believe it. If you love it, you will eat the fruit of this confession. Another name for Christianity, I found out, is confession. Do you know? Do you know that? Another name for Christianity is confession. 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 That's why you hear things like Apostle Creed. That's why you hear things like, you know, every time watch very well what we do is more like confession. We confess Christ. We believe in our hearts. We Until you confess, you're not yet a Christian. That's why I, I found that another name for Christianity is confession. That's all to become a child of God is the fruit of your mouth. You have to confess Jesus, period. That's it. And you become born again. The fruit of the mouth. Do you see how powerful this is? And then you're telling yourself, I cannot make it. You're telling yourself, he will, I, can, this, I cannot get this document. I, they will not attend to me. They will ignore my work. How can you confess that? Don't you know the power in this mouth that you're seeing? Can you imagine that a girl will leave the father and the mother because of the statement of a man? Because of the word of a man. Can you imagine? He will leave the father that gave birth, that, that produced her, and leave the mother that almost died in the labor room because of the word of mouth. <laughs> oh my God. <coughs> because 
because of the word, I can't even, it's not because of just the way, say, well, since he's been speaking to me, I can't take him out of my mind. I keep thinking about <laughs> Rakato sikatayama. Entre levels. The word of mouth. Very powerful. Very powerful. Make sure you are confessing something that will lift you up and not something that will bring you down. Make sure in Jesus' name. Make sure you are confessing over your children every day. That is where our life begins. Confessing. Ask and ye shall be given. Seek you will find. Knock it shall be opened unto you. Kayan daily musuka. For everyone that asks, receive it. Receive it. Everyone that seek with their mind, they will find. Everyone that knock. Ask asking with fasting. Knock. Asking with fasting. Knock. Asking and quoting the scripture. But it is written. Lord, it is written. You said in your word. Asking with proof. Of the word of God. Presenting the word of God to him. Said everyone that knocked the door will be opened unto them. In Jesus name. What is there <laughs> in that? Can a man give a stone when the son asks for bread? Jesus is asking the question. Or can they, a man give you know, serpent when fish is asked for? Ah, ah, come on man. Can a man be so cruel to the child that he will not attend to the child? If a man can, can do this, what can God do? If a man knows how to give good gifts, verse 11 is saying, Matthew 7, verse 11, how much more shall your father, which is in heaven, give good gifts to them that, what is the word? Ask him. Fruit of the mouth. Ask him. Ask. Because if you check that, ask and you seek and knock, the first letter still come back to A-S-K. It's asking. You can ask by physical saying it, you can seek it by searching for how to do it through the word of God. And you can knock using fasting, prayer and scripture, channel your desire to God. It is still asking. And if you can ask and you receive from your father, your mother, how much more if you ask God Almighty? My question is, how are you using the power of the tongue in your life how are you using the power of your tongue in your life this is it whatever you use your tongue to say god will maintain for you this is the fearful thing and this is what god has sent me to somebody on this mountain come on if you have been saying something negative go and cancel it because all god will maintain for you he can't maintain any other thing because all what you have been saying is men is wicked men are bad men are this men are cruel men cannot there's no man that will want to keep you as a wife this and that all the things you say god kept it for you you women are this women are that women are this women are that women are very well do they can frustrate you they can be god kept all what you said for you and that is what is coming to you every time i can never come out from this sickness this is how i'm going to be until i die i don't think there's healing for me the lord kept it the way you said it god kept it the lord preserved your statement psalms chapter 16 verse 1 the Lord preserve that statement. What I come on, go and destroy that thing. Go back and destroy that your order. Destroy that your order. Destroy that prayer mandate. Destroy that confession. If not, the Lord will maintain it. The Lord will maintain it. The Lord will maintain that lot. The Lord will maintain whatever has been said. It's not his job to correct what you said. It's not his job. His job is to say, be it unto Jumbo what Jumbo have just said. Be it unto Jumbo what Jumbo have just requested for. Be it unto be it unto that's the job of god and when he said be it unto he said stay there for eternity for him stay there for the nice self five years for him stay there imagine when you plant a seed and the lord say seed that has been planted by jumbo start to grow if i plant mango mango will come out when the food is fully grow if it is if it's any palm tree when it grows up then the fruit of palm tree will come it's as simple as that god will not change the seed no he doesn't play that God doesn't play, but God will maintain the seed. God will maintain the seed. God will maintain the seed. You who cost your child, go back and bless that child. You who cost your daughter, go back and bless your daughter. You who cost your wife, go back and bless your wife. You who cost your husband, go back and bless your husband. Stop creating problems. There's enough problem in the world. God sent you and me to create solutions. Not to add to the problem. The earth in this said is without form and void. But when God came, he brought solution. Bring solution. 
bring solution to the life of people. I will curse you, I will curse you. Why is it that that's what comes into the mind of people first? Why can't you think of, I will bless you when you are angry. When you are angry, why don't you think of blessing somebody? But that's what Jesus said in Matthew 5, 44. Bless somebody. He did not say, curse him, curse him, curse him. There's enough curses. God says, can you push those curses away? The way you pray and you, and you bless somebody. Psalm 16, verse 5 and 6. The Lord is the portion of my inheritance and my cup. Thou maintainest my Lord. Because God is the portion of your inheritance, everything that you, you channel into heaven will be maintained. Everything you shoot out. Everything you shoot out will meet with the power and the glory of God. Everything you shoot out into the spirit realm. What are you shooting out? What are you shooting out for God's sake? What are you shooting out? What are you shooting out? What are you shooting out? What is coming out from your mouth? What are you saying? What is your confession? God will not amend those confessions. It is for you to be careful because he is there. He is there. He, you are sowing into God. Like somebody sowing into the earth, whatever you are saying is into God Almighty. And he will bring the result and maintain it. What is God maintaining for some people? The lines are falling onto me on pleasant places. Some people, the line is coming to fall on them, but their confession has destroyed where the lines will fall onto. There is no base for the line to fall onto. The line is falling, but they confess something that destroyed the base. So how would they see the lines falling onto them? When God is telling me, and you create a base for all the lines to fall upon, <clears throat> I will release it, create that base. And if you have a base that the lines will fall upon, then you can say, I have a goodly or a godly heritage. I have a goodly heritage because a goodly heritage is also a godly heritage. It's a heritage that God can identify with. My question to somebody with all humility, can God identify with what you're doing? Can God identify in Jesus' name? Oh my God, Rabba Mosuka. Can God identify with what you're doing? God must be honored. Jesus must be honored. Christ must be honored in my life every day. Can God be honored by what you're doing? Can God be proud of your statement? If God come in and see what you're confessing over any situation, will God be proud? Are you sure what you are saying is what you want God to maintain for you? Are you sure whatever you are saying now over your loved ones, your family, your community, over your business, are you sure that's what you want God to maintain for you? If you are not, if you are, if that is not what you want God to maintain for you, say, God, in Jesus' name, let the power of the blood and the power of the Holy Spirit destroy such confession. In Jesus' name. Everyone that is loving, liking, pressing the like button, the love button, everyone pressing the share button, I hand you over to God. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord increase you. May the Lord increase your household. May the Lord increase everything that, that is connected to you in Jesus' name. What can we say to these things? What can we say to these things if God be for you? 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 Is God for you? Is God happy with what you are doing? Is God happy with what you are saying? What are you confessing? Somebody make a vow and say, in Jesus' name, I will not confess negativity anymore. Don't say it if you don't mean it. Don't say it if you don't mean it. Can I have a witness in the house? I will not confess negativity anymore. I will not confess negativity anymore. Instead of confessing, I'll keep quiet. If I don't know what to say, I'll keep quiet. If I don't know what to say, I'll keep quiet. Please, somebody, you are the one, you are the one God used to expand the word maintain. Confess only what you want God to maintain for you. You know what it means to sustain, to maintain, to keep, to keep fresh. Don't say what you don't want to see another five years from now. No need to say it. Why do such investment? That's a downward investment. When it is something you don't want to see after three, three months or three weeks, why say it? Say the one you want to see for the next 300 years. Come on, there are so many things we can say that we want to see. I will not confess any negativity anymore in Jesus' name. Don't say it if you don't mean it. Oh. Don't say it if you don't mean it. I am sent to somebody who is using the power of the mouth, the power of the tongue wrongly. 
That's why, why do you think the Isaiah made us, and the Isaiah is telling us that no weapon formed against us will prosper. No weapon. Except the one that we created, God forbid, with our confession, we will not create such in Jesus' name. Why do you think the book of Psalms says, I shall not die? You will not die in Jesus' name. I will not die. Death is not my portion. Death is not your portion. Why do you say, why do you think the psalmist say, preserve, O Lord. Preserve me, O Lord. May the Lord preserve you and me, oh, so that we do not leave that place of rightful confession. Rightful confession. I will not confess negativity anymore. I will never confess negativity in Jesus' name. I will never confess negativity because it, your spiritual belly will be satisfied with it. Trust me. When Bible says it will be satisfied, your spiritual belly will be satisfied with it and you don't want it, so don't confess it. If you're in business, you want more customers. Start to say it. I'm attending to so many customers. I'm having many customers. I'm having, I'm working, I'm meeting the needs of many customers. Confess what you want to see. I have a new job. If you are trusting God for a new job, if you are trusting God for a new job, if you are trusting God for the fruit of the womb, walk around, go to mother care and say, yes, yeah, that's for my baby. That one is for my baby. That's the kind of thing God wants us to do. Initially, everybody will think you're crazy. But watch those who confess. Watch those who confess. This is not, this is not, bragging or talking falsely this is confession consciously obeying the word of god say those things you want god to do i'm believing god for this god i believe you for this this will be my portion this is this this is that watch what will happen i told a story once of a man of god that kept on confessing that he's going to he's going to buy his house cash down <clears throat> he's going to buy his house cash down he put a picture of the house on the altar every day he's confessing I'm buying my house cash down. I'm buying my house cash down. I'm buying my house cash down. One day he was just checking in his account. So, so, so money came. And he's going to price the kind of house. He knows everything he needed. Immediately that money came. He just used the money and bought the house cash down. That's it. Cash down. And then they noticed, excuse me, something went wrong. Oh, the, I was supposed to put this. I'm sorry. I saw the money and I had the purpose. I've used it for that purpose. I admit, yes, there was, I saw a money in the, I believe it was God who provided it for the purpose I've been saying. And I bought the house. At, well, at, at the court, they told him you have to, you have to pay back. I say, I'm willing to pay back. And he started to pay back the money. How can you pay back? If I tell you what he decided to pay back. Well, that's his own, uh, the ex exact, um, the, that's the exact truth. He started paying back only 10, 10 of the local currency. 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 10. 10. I'm not joking. 10. Not 1,000. 10 units. 10. 10. Just 10. Like $10, 10, 10 pounds. Yes. He started paying that every month for the house. That's it. There's power in confession. Only God knows how he's going to do it. But he says he's going to pay at once. It's not going to be paying bit by bit. He will not miss out the house. He's going to pay the house and everything will be in his name. And he paid, truly. The Lord made a way. The Lord made a way. And it was approved for him. Where the, from the source the money came, it was not a problem if he paid that way. Can you imagine? Ten, ten, ten dollar or ten pound. He was paying every month for the exact house. The house he drew with everything, with the swimming pool, everything. The way he saw it. Heaven brought it for him. It took time, but then heaven brought it. And the Lord maintained what his prayer. The Lord maintained it the way he said it. He said he's going to pay at once in his name and everything. He's not going to be doing bit by bit. He's going to pay at once for it. And he came that way. He paid at once. Got all this paper. He's the owner of the house. There's no two ways about it. Sometimes certain things cannot be fathomed. But anybody who loves the fruit of it will eat from it. It's not me who said that's the Bible. That's the scripture. Some of you have said it once that I'm going to marry so so and so. I'm going to do this and that. Watch around you and see if that is it. Those who have been scared that I don't know, I don't want my marriage to be like this. So I don't want those who have been saying fear. Watch around you and see. After years, see if that fear is not about to be a reality. All you need to do quickly go back to God, plead the blood of Jesus Christ. If it is negative, you've been confessing, and the blood of Jesus, the power of the Holy Spirit, will take it away for you. That's it. That's it. That is it. So that's why you know that every time we are coming to pray on the mountain, we are not wasting time. 
Every day, we can repeat the same thing for one year. It's not wasting time. Everyone that been, some people on this mountain, after three months, they got exactly what they were requesting for. Somebody after two months, got exactly what they requested for. Somebody after four months, he requested for about five or six things. Everything has been done. Only one is left. Everything from paper to this to that to that, everything has been done. Only one is left. And that one is in the pipeline. Yes, everything has been done. From, from paper to job to husband to everything. Now husband relocate. Once the husband relocate, then you can guess what the last thing is. It's going to happen straight away. That's it. And all that prayer is done. You see, there's a sister on this mountain that kept on saying, oh, I want my marriage to be successful. If you were on this mountain last year, you will know the person I'm talking about without gain saying, she would always, she doesn't ask for any other thing. Husband, um, my husband, my children, my twin children, my this and that. As we speak now, she's pregnant. Marriage was a success. She posted the marriage in the uh, ma in the messenger. She posted it. Beautiful, lovely, you know, uh, marriage. I even saw herself and the husband going around the tree and I'm wondering, excuse me, where did you get the tree of life? I want to come there also. I want to go around it. I want to see. I want to be and they started laughing. You know, they were going around the trees. A beautiful wedding. Now she's pregnant, just like she's been confessing. What are you saying to God? What is your confession? The time it will come to pass is what we don't know. Time is in the hands of God. Time is not in my hand. It's not in your hand. That one is in the hands of God. But whether it will come to pass or not, don't, be, don't even worry about that. God will not only bring it to pass. God will maintain. God will maintain whatever you have been confessing. It's time for us to pray. It's time for us to confess. I know people have been confessing during the preaching, during the preaching, and every word that has been coming in, I soak with the blood of Jesus Christ and make, may those words become a reality for you and your household. I say may all those confessions become a reality for you and your household. Can we start to pray in Jesus' name? Holy Spirit, say stop there. Everyone in Jesus' name, put in your prayer mandate right now in Jesus' name. What do you want God to do? The power of life and death is in the power, is in the tongue. The power of life and death, life and death are in the power of the tongue and anyone who uses it will get the profit god will even when you use it god will maintain whatever you have if you speak death the lord will maintain it if you speak life god will maintain it we can use death in a positive way when you command cancer to die that is a positive way of using the power of death cancer must die sicknesses must die the spirit of depth upon depth upon depth must die this is how to use death positively it must die. Anything that is condemning you in the body, in your spirit soul, must die. Period. End of story. They have to. They have to die. Let us start to pray. Let us start to pray. Somebody in the name of Jesus Christ, God wants to hear you. God doesn't want to hear nobody except you. You are all God wants to hear speaking now. Uh, who is the person talking to God? Who is that person speaking to God? You are the only one God wants to hear speaking right now. It's time to talk to the Lord. Re kaba shandali mus. O karaba musuka. Radeli eketeli. Teri man teli man katosi kataba. Somebody lift up your voice right now. Let's talk to the reigning king. Let's talk to I am that I am. Let's talk to him. Let's talk to him. Let's talk to him who is able to do exceedingly abundantly more than we, what we can ever imagine or think in the name of Jesus Christ. Re kaba shandali musuka. Somebody in the name of Jesus Christ, God wants to hear you. Are you speaking? Are you saying something? Are you speaking? Are you saying something? Are you typing something over your children, over yourself, over your children, over your loved ones? Are you typing something? Are you saying something? In the name of Jesus Christ, may the Lord hear you. May the Lord hear you. May the Lord approve. May the Lord approve all your prayer mandate. I soak every prayer mandate I soak. I soak every prayer mandate with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ. May the Lord make a difference. Make a difference, a clear difference between you and everyone between you and everyone. May the Lord make a difference. Everyone that is not serving God, the Lord make a difference between you serving God and the one not serving God. And may the Lord have mercy upon everyone who wants to get into that line of serving the living God. In the name of Jesus Christ, I soak every prayer mandate with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Any form of natural disaster that wants to disturb anyone at any location i command the mercy of god the glory of god to speak over you and your household to speak over you, you and your household over your community over your nation over wherever the lord has you know planted you right now in jesus name i pray i pray i pray in jesus name everyone under the sound of my voice 
<coughs> cancel right now any form of negative confession that you have made knowingly and unknowingly. Any negative confession, Daddy, it was made in error. Tell him, say, I cancel it in Jesus' name. I cancel. Say, I cancel every, every confession that I have made in error. I cancel in Jesus' name. Cancel every confession. Derima, shake about Tosuko. Ola deleketeli o satali. Inka kakaban tolio zikata. Remadi ekelio. Oh Lord, teach us how to pray. Teach us what to say. That it get us conscious, oh God, whenever I want to say anything that is not in line with your will. In Jesus' name, somebody say with me, oh Lord, maintain those prayer mandates you have given to me that I have prayed. Maintain those prayer mandates in the name of Jesus. Maintain those prayer mandates in La Dele Mosoka. Rabbani Ekelio Zikantayaba. Maintain it for me, oh Lord, bring it to pass in Jesus' name. Every negative confession we uproot, we uproot, we uproot. Every negative conf confession we uproot through the power of the blood of Jesus. Christ, we are through the power, power. We are through the power of the Holy Spirit and the blood of Jesus. May the blood speak over your church, Daddy. May the blood speak over your church in Jesus' name. Lagetele mo sukaiba. Your perfect will maintain, O oh God, those lines. Daddy, grant us the grace to speak, O oh God, the things that will create the platform for the lines to fall onto us on pleasant places. Somebody join me and say, Oh Lord, help me, use me, grant me the grace to speak, to speak, to speak those things that will create the platform that will create the platform for the lines of God to fall onto me and my household on pleasant places. Lord, use me, oh God. Use me to say the things. Use me to say the things to create a platform. Use me to say the things to create the right platform on which right now all the lines, all the things that you have intended before the foundations of the earth, Lord, will fall onto me and my household on pleasant places on a pleasant note somebody in jesus name your children shall excel the kind of children you've been hoping for why did you stop confessing keep confessing those things those children you're hoping for is what god will send those same children you're hoping for those same children you're hoping for god will send confess keep confessing confess confess in jesus name confess in the name of man confess right now confess by fire by force those sets of children you've been trusting god for those those sets of children, the way you want them to excel in life and in destiny. Don't stop confessing because that is what God is bringing your way. That is what God is letting into your net in the name of Jesus Christ. Every, every blueprint of God, that is the line with which you will speak. You will not speak outside the blueprint of God for you. You will speak only in harmony. You will speak only in harmony with the blueprint of God for your life. You will speak only in harmony with the blueprint of God for you and your family in the name of Jesus Christ. You will speak only in line with the blueprint of God for you. In the name of Jesus Christ. He is, he is what he say he is in your life. I soak, I soak, I soak every man with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Put in your prayer mandate. I'll start to round up right now, please. In the name of Jesus Christ, put in your prayer mandate. Somebody under the sound of my voice, put in your prayer mandate as we start to round up right now on this mountain here and now in the name of Jesus Christ. Every man like tell you everyone pressing the love button, like button, everyone pressing the like button, pressing the love button, double blessing, double blessing, double honor, double blessing, increase, increase on every side in Jesus' name. I soak you grace C with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you ye w with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. Every prayer that you're praying on this mountain today, may the Lord look down, look down upon you, your household, look down upon your prayer in Jesus' name with mercy, with mercy and grace in the name of Jesus. May the Lord look down upon your prayer with mercy and grace. I soak you with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you. Mary R. I soak you. Mary R. with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Everything that the Lord has commanded consigning you and your household. Everything that you're trusting the Lord for which must surely come to pass was fall into line for you and your and your lineage in the name of Jesus Christ. I see you in Libremo Sikataba. Rejoicing in the Lord, sharing testimony in Jesus' name. Brenda W, I soak you with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. The mercy of God, the glory of God speak over you and your household. Everyone with me on this live transmission, everyone that will be watching the recorded version, the glory of God speak over you. Oh, Tolu, I soak you with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. We, w, Patricia, I soak you, I soak you. Wilson P, I soak you. I soak you with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ. Ray Baka, Telimo, Christiana, D.O., I soak you with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. The mercy of God shine over you. 
the grace of God shine over you, the mercy of God shine over you, the kindness of God, the light of God shine over you in Jesus name. Baru J, I soak you with the power and the precious blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you. I soak you with the power and the precious blood of Jesus Christ. Maria Ma J, I soak you with the power and the precious blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you. Sheila P J, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you. Anjuma, I soak you. Anjuma, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Your prayer mandate, I soak with the blood of Jesus. May the Lord lift up. May the Lord lift up. May the Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you in Jesus' name. May the Lord maintain your prayer mandate, O Tolu. May the Lord maintain the prayer mandate of everyone under the sound of my voice. Grace C, I soak you, Grace C. I soak you, Grace C, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Orlando, I soak you, Orlando. I soak you with the mercy of God, the glory of God, the power of God. I soak you, I soak every member of your household. I soak you, I soak you, Kimberly Lawson, with the power and the precious blood of Jesus Christ. Leke Baro Osaka. Jean Tele Manteli Manteli. In the name of Jesus Christ, I soak you with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Reke Leto Zika. I soak you, I soak you, Millicent O, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. <clears throat> I soak you, Millicent O, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, Helen. I soak you, Helen L M, with the power and the blood. I soak you, Helen L M. I soak you, soak you, with the power and the precious blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, Sherry H. I soak you, Christiana D O, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak everyone under the sound of my voice on this mountain. May the words of your mouth and the meditations of your heart be acceptable in the sight of God Almighty, Alpha, Omega, in Jesus' name. May the words of your mouth, the meditations of your heart, be acceptable before God Almighty, be acceptable before the Redeemer, be acceptable before God Almighty, be acceptable before the Redeemer. Lebromoso kakalimo si kantaiba. Gracie, I soak you, I soak you. Hallelujah, I soak you with the power and the blood of Jesus. In la grelemosoka, rabani eketelio, in manto. In Jesus' name, may the Lord teach us what to say. May the Lord speak through us. May the Lord pray through us. May the Lord make his will to be done. May the Lord make his face to shine upon us and be gracious unto us. In the name of Jesus Christ, may the Lord lift up the light of his countenance over us, over our household. May God grant us peace. May the Lord grant us peace. In the name of Jesus Christ, peace in all confession. Everyone that is saying, I will no more confess negativity, receive strength from God in Jesus' name. D. Thompson, I soak you. D. Thompson, with the power and the precious blood of Jesus Christ, I soak you. D. Thompson, Nebra Loco Saka, Rekaba Shanteli Eketelio, Brenda W. I soak you with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, Anne Marie, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, Maru J, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name, everything start to favor you, favor your children, favor everyone related to you by blood. Helen L. M. I soak you in the power with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, I soak you, Judith C. With the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Tina S. I soak you, I soak everyone under the sound of my voice. I soak everyone with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name, I soak you, Margaret. I soak you, Margaret KB. I soak you, Margaret KB, with the power and the precious blood of Jesus. Margaret KB, everyone with all humility under God that is pressing the like button, everyone pressing the love button, everyone pressing the share button, honest to God, I lift you up before the mercy tone of God as he has commanded me to say, may the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord grant you double, double, double blessing in jesus name may the lord make his face to shine upon you shine upon you shine upon your household may the lord show you kindness and mercy in jesus name i say may the lord show you kindness and mercy may the mercy of god shine 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 over you over your household in jesus name lay back at us in daily get tell you oh rabba mosuka jan tell him i tell you i soak everyone with the power and the precious blood of jesus christ power and the precious blood every prayer man they coming into the house somebody please Please put in the prayer mandate. This is my last call. Put in your prayer mandate, please. Put in your prayer mandate. The Holy Spirit is here. Confess what you want God to do over your son, over your marriage, over your situation, over your circumstance. Confess those things in Jesus' name. And as you are confessing, the Lord is establishing in the name of Jesus Christ. Mariama, the Lord establish your heart desire. Christiana D, oh, the Lord establish your heart desire. Orlando, the Lord establish your heart desire. Otolu, the Lord ex establish your heart desire. Whatever your desire is, the Lord establish in Jesus' name. I so I soak, I soak, I soak, I soak. Good is set. I soak you, M. Good is set with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. May the Lord establish your heart desires in the name of Jesus Christ. May the Lord establish, establish, Sherry H. The Lord establish all your heart desires, all your confession, all your positive confession, and those negative confession towards. 
things like cancer, those negative confession towards things like cancer, spirit of death, as you say, it should die in your life. It will die truly in Jesus' name. It will die off. It will die out. It will die off. It will die out. In Jesus' name, you are no more struggling with all such, uh, such things. You are not struggling with the spirit of death. You are not struggling with cancer. You are not struggling with any form of sickness. You are not struggling with any form of setback in the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord enlighten the Lord enlarge your coast. The Lord grant you joy and peace. La batelmo osa jenketeli entalio ribramo o karabanteli je baketeli mo sukatayaba. Helen, I soak you with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. And Juma, I soak you. I soak everyone pressing the like the love button. I soak everyone sowing the seed on this mountain. Pressing one comment or the other in Jesus' name. Pressing the share button. Double double blessing. May the Lord honor you. May the Lord grant you all that you're seeking for. All that you are asking for, may the Lord visit you. May the Lord visit you greatly. Visit your household. May the Lord visit your loved ones in the name of Jesus Christ. Everyone that is watching me right now, everyone that is communicating to God with verbally, or everyone communicating through their through their mind meditation, may the Lord hear you. May the Lord show you that He is God. Because on this mountain we say it can only be God. I soak you, Sherry. I soak you. I soak you, Sherry H, with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, Sheila P J, with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. Lord, somebody under the sound of my voice, may the Lord prove to you. May the Lord prove to you and may you join us to say it can only be God in the name of Jesus Christ. Every, every spirit of lump, any form of lump die in Jesus' name. Every cancer die in Jesus' name. Every sickness die. That's how to use the power of death. Die. Because that's the temple of God. You're not meant to be there. You're defiling that temple. Die in Jesus' name. Every promise and fail die in Jesus' name. Every wrong conception, every wrong conception every wrong understanding die off in Jesus name every spirit of conflict die in Jesus name be destroyed every power of death and hell every power of hell grave and death die in Jesus name nobody nobody under the sound of my voice when I say die is lose your power lose your grip lose your activity in the lives of God people in Jesus name I soak you Brenda W I soak you Maro J I soak everyone Orlando on on, on this mountain with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ Mary R I soak you with the power and the precious blood of Jesus Christ Jocelyn H I soak you I soak you with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. J. William, I soak you with the power of the precious blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, Paul A., with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. Christiana D. O. I soak you with the power of the blood of Jesus. E. Tarima Reketelio. Sherry H. I soak you, soak you, soak you. Sherry H. E. Grelimo Osaka. Ladele E. Teliman Katosi. Ibramo Sokatayaba. In the name of Jesus Christ. Every prayer mandate you're lifting up, consigning your neighbor, consigning anyone in Jesus' name. May the Lord approve those prayer mandates. May the Lord God Almighty approve, approve, approve. May the Lord approve those prayer mandate. May the Lord approve those prayer mandate by fire, by force in Jesus' name. Everyone, everyone that needs the power to walk away from speaking negativity over your life. First, every negativity that has been confessed by somebody who is saying, Oh Lord, let the power of the Holy Spirit destroy. Holy Spirit destroy every power of negativity over children, over marriage, over home, over business, over career, over anything and everything. <clears throat> we command that power to be destroyed. We command the power of grave to be destroyed. We command the power of grave, the power of setback, the power of pain, the power of shame to be destroyed by fire, by force in the name of Jesus Christ. Everyone under the sound of my voice. Everyone, 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 anyone, everyone, under the sound of my voice, may the Lord honor you. May the Lord honor you. May the Lord honor you in the name of Jesus Christ. I say, may God honor you. God punish the devil. May the Lord honor you. May the Lord honor you. May the Lord hear you. May the Lord hear you when you call. May the name of the Lord God Almighty defend you in Jesus' name. May the Lord God defend, defend you, defend Defend your household in the name of Jesus Christ. Karabato Suka, Letrenemo Osaka, Deli Entelio, Kon Talimo Suka, Bali Ekelie. In the name of Jesus Christ, may the Lord honor you, may the Lord lift you up, may the Lord bless you and keep you in Jesus' name. May the Lord teach you what to say in every circumstance. May the Lord teach us what to say in the name of Jesus Christ, because Bible says the word is near our mouth. The word is near our mouth in Jesus' name, and we will confess rightly. We will confess correctly. Maroje, I soak you. 
with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, Orlando, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I soak you, I soak you, Otolu, with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Sherry H, I soak you, Sherry H, with the power and the precious blood of Jesus. I soak, I soak, I soak in Jesus' name. I soak everyone daily, Makaba, Shikatosi, in Deliketelio, Kora, and Dali Mosuka, Rabbani Eketelio, Konta Mosika, Tayaba, E Karibali Ketelio, in the name of Jesus Christ, Ragaga, Ragaga Dalaga, Raga Dalaga Dayagaba, Remagaba Zikatosuka, in Kaleman Teliman Katosi Kayanda, in the name of Jesus Christ, Hallelujah, Kremaga Delimo Osakra, Jaliman Kelimo Tolion Zikatayaba, in the name of Jesus Christ, God, we give you praise, Daddy, we give you praise, God, we honor you in Jesus' name, thank you for all that you have done, somebody under the sound of my voice pressing the like button, the Lord honor you, double, double blessing, somebody pressing the share button, the Lord honor you, double, double blessing, everyone under the sound of my voice in Jesus' name, looking up, up, up unto God, asking God for the way out, the Lord honor you, the Lord honor you, the Lord lift you up, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus Christ, the Lord honor you, the Lord lift you up, the Lord honor you, the Lord lift you up, in Jesus' name, so shall it be. So shall it be, so shall it be in Jesus' name. If you like to give your life to Jesus Christ, you're under the sound of my voice. If you like to give your life to Jesus Christ, stretch forth your hand towards me and say, Lord Jesus, say I come before you. I confess every sin that I've committed knowingly and unknowingly. Wash me clean through the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Say with me, oh Lord, every, every covenant that I have made, knowingly and unknowingly, every wrong negative confession that I have made, knowingly and unknowingly, Daddy, let the power of the Holy Spirit destroy every negative confession, destroy any negative confession that is being maintained on my behalf in the spiritual realm. Let it be destroyed by the fire of the Holy Spirit. Let it be destroyed by the fire of the Holy Spirit. Let the blood of Jesus speak great things concerning me. Somebody say, let the blood of Jesus speak great things concerning me. Let the blood of Jesus speak great things concerning me in the name of Jesus Christ. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. Please say with me that I believe Jesus died for me. It was buried for my sake and for my sake it was lifted from the grave please say with me i believe in my heart and i confess with my mouth so i find salvation somebody say with me say i'm born again say i'm born again say i'm born again and it is binding in the name of jesus christ praise god hallelujah praise god praise god hallelujah please in the name of jesus christ if you like to dedicate your life say i dedicate say i dedicate say i dedicate my life unto you alpha omega and it is binding also in the name of jesus christ praise god if you like to rededicate your love and life, say, I rededicate my love and life. Please say, I rededicate my love and life. Please say, I rededicate my love and life unto you, Alpha, Omega, beginning and the end, and so shall it be in Jesus' name. Everyone under the sound of my voice, get said because God loves you is a statement of fact. God loves you is a reality that must, must surely come to pass in Jesus' name. Let us pray. Eternal Rock of Ages, Alpha, Omega, beginning and the end. Daddy, we ascribe all glory and honor unto you. Daddy, we say, come and do what you alone can do. Daddy, honor and glorify your name in our life. Eternal Rock of Ages, beginning and the end. I pray, O Lord, for everyone that has given their life unto you. Daddy, grant, O God, the grace, O God, to come into deeper relationship with you. May the blood of Jesus speak over us. May the blood speak. May the blood speak. May the blood speak on common financial visitation. May the blood speak supernatural breakthrough. May the blood speak. May the blood speak. May the blood speak. May the blood speak over us, our household. May the blood speak in the name of Jesus Christ. Shantai Abalike tell you spiritual blessing. And may the blood help us. May the blood of Jesus help us as we confess to confess exactly the mind of God and nothing contrary to the mind and the will of God in Jesus' name. Thank you, blessed Redeemer. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, blessed Redeemer. We give you praise, we honor you. In the name of Jesus Christ, thank you, Daddy. Thank you, ancient of this. Thank you, beginning and the end. Thank you, ancient of this. Thank you, beginning and the end. We honor you, we give you praise, praise God. We honor you, we give you praise, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Honor and glory unto you. We give you praise, be thou exalted. In Jesus' name we have decreed. In the name of Jesus Christ we have decreed. In Jesus' name we have decreed. Amen, amen, and amen. Praise God. Somebody join me to say congratulations. Join me to say congratulations, congratulations, congratulations to everyone that has given their life unto Jesus Christ on this mountain. Please look for a Bible believing church. Prayerfully join the church. As you join the church, introduce yourself to the pastor. Pastor will pray with you and grant you or give you a department. Please make sure you serve God in that department and not man. And as you serve God in Jesus' name, 
God will honor you from his throne in Jesus' name. And your confession, he will approve in Jesus' name. God bless you. Everyone under the sound of my voice that has come to pray with me, God bless you. I love you so much. Shalom, shalom, shalom. I pray in Jesus' name that God continue to teach us how to make good use of the mouth and the power of the tongue. In Jesus' name, God bless you. God bless you. You will create positive. You will create positive wall around you. You will create the original mind of God run about you. And the Lord will maintain it for you. The job of God is to maintain. It is your job to create. You create with your confession. And you will create perfect wall for yourself. In Jesus name. But if there's anything you've seen in this broadcast that made you very happy. Please join me in Jesus name. If there's anything you've seen in this broadcast that made you happy. Join me in Jesus name to say it can only be God. It can only be God. It can only be God. Join me to say it can only be God. God honor you. God bless you. Please, if you like to know whenever I'm online, please, in the name of Jesus Christ, immediately after this broadcast, press follow. Press the word follow. Or come to my profile wall, Jumbo Isong. Press follow on my profile wall. If you can find my page, it's called JB Isong. Like and follow the page. You will know whenever I'm online. And please, if you do not mind, I strongly recommend that you subscribe to our YouTube channel, Unbounded House. So subscribe to it so that whenever we are online, you will know. We come live also on the YouTube in the second broadcast. So you need to type Unbounded House Live into the YouTube, search for it, and you will be part of the program in the second broadcast. <coughs> or you can come to my profile wall if you can. If you can, come to my profile wall. If there is a link there, you can join from the link. However, type in Unbounded House Live into the YouTube is a better option and a quicker one. God bless you. There is a group in, a, in on Facebook that is affiliated to this mountain. It's called Faith Clinic and Healing Atmosphere. Type it into the search engine. And as you type it, it's going to come up. Indicate you want to join. Anybody can add you. God bless you. Today is your birthday. God bless you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. God bless you. God bless everyone under the sound of my voice. Happy birthday. God bless you. More, day, more age with grace. God bless you. Let's pray. Eternal Rock of Ages, I give you praise and I thank you. For everyone you are giving the grace, O oh Lord, to be in this broadcast. Father, it can only be you. It just can only be you in Jesus' name. Lord, I soak every man, I soak every woman, I soak everyone, everyone under the sound of my voice with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name, Daddy, bless and protect and guide your church. Bless and protect and guide us in Jesus' name. Our confidence and trust is in you remarkable god alpha omega beginning and the end in jesus name do what you alone can do adonai in the name of jesus christ praise god i pray i pray i pray for everyone related to everyone on this mountain daddy they will every negativity confess look upon everyone that has prayed on this mountain let the blood speak over our loved ones and our relations far and near in jesus name i pray for everybody under the sound of my voice that is in the hospital prison home or somebody representing anyone in the hospital prison and in their homes may the lord have mercy may the lord hear your cry over that person in the hospital prison and somebody in the homes. May the Lord have mercy. May the Lord have mercy. May the Lord make a way in Jesus' name. I pray for every parent. God see you through. Every parent in Jesus' name. God see you through. You will reap the fruit of your labor in, positively in Jesus' name. And the Lord will preserve your seeds in the land of the living. They will be great. They will be great in the land of the living in Jesus' name. I soak everyone one more time with the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. Everyone working, everyone, everyone working, everyone student, every student, everyone married, everyone trusting God for their marriage, anyone in any calamity, in every capacity. May the Lord make a way for you. May the Lord hear you. May the Lord answer to your cry. Please be careful from today. Confess what you want God to maintain for you and he will do it out of his magnanimity. We give him praise in Jesus' name. Unto God who is gracious in keeping, I commit to you. <clears throat> May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May the Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you, upon your household, upon whatsoever you are invited to do, upon whosoever is connected to you by blood. May the Alpha, Omega, beginning and the end. May the ancient of days, the first and the last. May God grant you peace. May the Lord grant you peace. May the Lord grant you peace now and forevermore. Amen, so shall it be. Amen, so shall it be. Amen, so shall it be in Jesus' name. Somebody under the sound of my voice, please remember to press follow so that you know whenever I'm online is very important. <coughs> remember to press, 
follow so that you know whenever I'm online, I live in the hands of the Holy Spirit. May the blessings of today be permanent in your life. May all the things God have taught us today be permanent in your life. May the Lord continue to increase you. May the Lord continue to make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. God bless you. I love you all. I live in the hands of the Holy Spirit. We'll meet later on today in the second broadcast and it's going to be much more powerful in Jesus' name. May God continue to increase each and every one of us. Remember, it's the Holy Spirit that says it's going to be powerful. I only confess it and I believe it. And I always see the mercy of God. You will see the mercy of God also. Shalom. God bless you. God bless you. Bye-bye. God bless you. Bye-bye. God bless you.